Hi, Dave Jack here, superintendent of Fokker County Public Schools with another edition of Three Great Things. Um, I have some really cool things to share with you. Uh, I want to start off with Coleman Elementary School. So the um, fifth grade students, or some of the fifth grade students at Coleman Elementary entered a contest uh, that was sponsored by Michael and Sons. And so they were looking for a creative jingle um, from one up from a school, I guess, within Northern Virginia, DC area, and the prize for comp the school that came up with the most creative and innovative jingle was twenty five hundred dollars and a visit uh, by or visit from the Michael from Michael and Sons. Uh, so, sure enough, um, they the students at Coleman won the jingle competition. So on Friday. Uh, I was able to visit Coleman and um, uh, participate or and attend when uh, the folks from Michael and Sons came in, handed a big giant check for twenty five hundred bucks to uh, Coleman Elementary School, and then the the fifth grade students actually performed the jingle, um, led by Miss Hall, who is their uh, the the new uh, I think she's new this year a new. Um, music teacher at Coleman Elementary School and she's she's doing a fantastic job and the kids did extremely well so hats off and congratulations to the kids at Coleman um, I was also able to I visited Bradley Elementary and Miss Sukup's class had a visit from uh, a can the canine unit from the Fauquier County Sheriff's Office lady was the dog beautiful dog I don't know what kind of dog it is it looks like a pointer but she was beautiful Anyway, she's an explosives dog, so I guess she's trained to sniff out explosives. And um, so uh, the handler, and I apologize for forgetting his name, but the, the handler from the sheriff's office was able to do a demonstration with the students in Miss Sukup's class. And uh, but beautiful dog, and I took a couple pictures, so hopefully we'll be able to get that and include them in this um, in this short broadcast. And. Uh, good segue into the third great thing um, Sheriff Mosier and I were able to do a, a PSA regarding online social media oriented uh, threats uh, particularly social media but in, threats in general against school uh, against schools, school personnel because unfortunately this year we've had uh, instances of this and it's very unfortunate and it's very stressful uh, so the sheriff and I decided we would do this PSA, and uh, I'm not sure when it's coming out, but hopefully it'll be out this week. Um, but I, I wanted to mention this because um, we have traditionally had an excellent relationship with the Fokker County Sheriff's Office, and they've they've always been willing to work half hand in hand with us. Um, and it's typically dealing with with you know some unpleasant things, but but not always. Um, but the, the sheriff and I have always had a great relationship and just our school division in general along with the sheriff's office has always had a very strong relationship and um, been able to work hand in hand especially in terms of putting out news releases and um, collaborating together in order to do some problem solving uh, for, in terms of various incidents and, and problems etc so um, with that PSA I think just a demonstration of uh, Sheriff Mosier is a great guy and an excellent sheriff and um, is committed to Fokker County Public Schools and the students of Fokker County Public Schools and that was demonstrated again by his willingness to participate in this PSA so thanks uh, to Sheriff Mosier and, and all the folks at the Fokker County Sheriff's Office so those are my three great things I hope everyone has a great week thanks